Hello students, in today's lecture, we will see a problem based on regular falsi method under numerical methods. The problem is find the smallest positive root of the equation x square minus log x to the base e my is equal to 12 by regular falsi method which lies between 3.6 and 3.7. See the advantage here. So they have given already the uh, simplified root. So we'll go directly. No need of checking in the calculator and all. We have to go directly. So solution. Solution. The problem, uh, the given function f of x is f of x is equal to x square minus log x to the base e base e if they have given well and good if not also it is nothing but base e only this 12 you have to take inside that it will become minus 12 so given given roots are so the given roots are 3.6 and 3.7 so the given roots are 3.7 and uh, sorry 3.6 and 3.7 now we will check what is the value of 3.6 and 3.7 in the uh, uh, for we will see which one is positive which one is negative. So f of 3.6 will check and similarly we need to check f of 3.7 also. Let us see the results here for 3.6 and 3.7. Here you will no, no need to check here. Now we will type this equation in the calculator. So alpha x square minus so log of x to the base e so if log x or log x to the base e if they have given we have to use the option lan in the calculator lan of x lan of x minus 12 go for calc option so once what so 3.6 will check so x value is 3.6 so it will be your it is showing how much here 0 0.3209 okay so we will write it it is minus 0 0.3209 similarly we will go for the value of uh, again calc option uh, x is equal to 3.7 3.7 equal to so it is 0 0.3816 means uh, 0 0.3817 I will take for decimal place which is positive so 0 0.3817 so this is negative value this is positive both the values already it is given in the question so we have to use this uh, value and we need to work out so therefore so what supposed to be uh, the already it is root so therefore first iteration so first iteration the formula is x1 is equal to a f of b minus b f of a divided by f of b minus f of a so therefore uh, a value from the question or uh, root it is a value is nothing but 3.6 b value is 3.7 so a value is what here that is 3.6 b value is 3.7 f of a that is f of 3.6 is minus 0 0.3209 f of b value is 0 0.3817 so once we get this we need to apply so for the first iteration uh, i will show the substitution remaining will go directly so a value is 3.6 then f of b that is f of b value will write directly here so f of b value is f of b value is 0 0.3817 0 0.3817 minus so b b value is 3.7 and f of a so f of a value is minus 0 0.3209 divided by f of b minus f of a so f of b is 0 0.3817 minus f of a value is minus 0 0.3209 so these values we need to apply in the calculator so i will go directly uh, a preparation of the this formula in the calculator so this a f of b minus b f of a divided by f of b minus f of a will use the calculator uh, and will get the formula for this so fraction so b a that is alpha a into bracket 
we have to prepare the formula you know very well how to prepare it so i will prepare directly now okay so it is alpha b square minus so log what we have here log x to the base e it is so log x to the base e means uh, it is ln we have to use ln of alpha x minus 12 close the bracket minus b into f of a that is alpha b bracket f of a that equation we have to write in terms of a that is alpha a square minus log of that is ln we have to use ln of alpha a minus 12 close the bracket come down then again alpha uh, alpha into f of b it is alpha into b square minus ln of alpha b minus 12 close the bracket minus bracket then alpha a square minus ln of alpha a minus 12 close the bracket go for calc option so it will ask the value of a so here right now for the present problem a value is 3.6 b value is 3.7 and see the answer here so it is coming 3.6456 so i will round up four decimal place so it will become 3.6457 so x1 is 3.6457 so once we get this we have to test this uh, this value we need to check in the above expression in this expression we have to test it so that uh, we'll see that uh, it is getting positive or negative if it is coming positive so if it is coming positive we have to update uh, 3.7 if you get negative we have to update 3.6 so let's see who is going to be updated here that is we'll, con we'll consider this one as in second iteration so second iteration so we need to test for f of 3.6457 in the above expression that is 3.6457 square minus log to the base e of 3.6457 minus 12 so let's see the answer here what will be so already it is typed in the calculator so use the center cursor button so it is available you can see here so it is x square minus ln of x minus 12 so i will uh, press the value of x as 3.6 four five seven and see what is the answer so we got negative value so that is a minus two point four one nine nine so on in it interest to minus three so i will arrange and i will write that one as it is minus zero point zero zero two four one nine so it is negative value so negative it is coming because of what here 3.6457 so here we got negative value because of 3.6 so we have to replace the negative that is in place of 3.6 we have to write 3.6457 therefore the fresh roots are therefore the root lies in the root lies in 3.6457 comma 3.7 therefore the value of a will be 3.6457 the value of b will be 3.7 value of f of a will be 0 minus 0 0.002199 so on and value of f of b it is already we got from the previously 3.7 the value is 3 0 0.3817 so therefore x2 formula will be a 
f of b minus b f of a divided by f of b minus f of a so this formula already we have typed in the calculator use center cursor button so it is available so this is a formula already go for calc option so a value is 3.6457 3.6457 check once again 3.6457 equal to sign then b value is 3.7 3.7 equal to sign and you will see that the answer will be 3.78637 so i will consider as 3.7864 So once again I will repeat here, so A value is 3.6457, B value is 3.7, so answer will be 3.6460, 3.6460, so this value so we need to again you can see that uh, the previous value is uh, 3.6457 and the fresh value is 3.6460 so we will go for one more iteration here so now so we will apply this value in the form of third iteration so third iteration we need to check for f of 3.6460 that is 3.6460 square minus log to the base e of 3.6460 minus 12 so this will be if you check this value in the calculator so uh, you will get so just see it is x square minus ln of x minus 12 so go for calc option so x value is out here 3.6460 so you will get a minus 3.1467 so on 10 raised to minus 4 so minus again it is coming so minus 0 0.0003146 so on so therefore negative value so negative value means what here so this root is going to be again updated we got that is in place of uh, 3.6457 we will write the fresh root is the root lies in 3.6460,3.7 so a value is 3.6460 b value is 3.7 f of a value will be just now we got it minus 0 0.0003146 f of b value already we got it it is 0 0.3817 so therefore the formula is x3 is equal to a f of b minus b f of a divided by f of b minus f of a so therefore so we will uh, apply directly the a value is in the calculator b value so you can uh, check here in the calculator so go for calc option so if you apply a value as 3.6460 b value is 3.7 and the resultant is 3.606460 uh, we got the same x3 value is how much here 3.6460 six four six zero only we got it so x2 value also same you can see here in the previous this is x3 value this is x3 value and x2 value also same so we'll stop because both results are same so therefore we will conclude that thus thus the required required root is 3.6460 so in this way we need to simplify a problem for x square minus log x to the base e equal to 12 by using regular falsy method.